G'day guys, back again. Um, all right, this is for uh, Bush Bush Class USA. Uh, the Bush Class tree ID. This is tree number two. This is the um, the black wattle, which is part of the acacia family. I don't know the exact name. I'll look that up and um, I'll post that on the um, on the forum. Okay, a couple of uses for this tree here. Obviously, uh, the wood, very hard wood, um, burns extremely hot. This stuff doesn't burn for long, but it burns very hot. So, if you've got a um, slow combustion stove or something like that, not recommended to use it because it'll burn the ass clean out of it. All right, um, food wise. See if I can find some here. You can get the um, if you can find it. You get these little balls of sap coming out of it, and uh, when you want to find some, you just can't. All right. Yeah, but the sap can be eaten. Um, apparently, it's uh, quite sweet. Um, what else? The seed pods on the uh, on the tree, and this doesn't have any of them either at this stage. But uh, the seeds can be taken and ground into a flour and baked. Uh, these are the branches here, and uh, there we go. That's that's what the leaves look like. Very thin. Um, you know, alternating down down the stem. Uh, it's a bit early in the season for the uh, for the seed pods, but once you get them on here, there's you get quite a few. Uh, like I said, can be ground down and um, made into a flower. Whoop! Head over turkey almost. Also, they say that the um, the timber can be used for bow drill fire. Haven't tried it. Um, but yeah, apparently it's very good timber for that. There's a uh, there's another one over there, probably a better better looking tree. Um, yeah, but anyway, that's my uh, second tree for the uh, tree ID. Um, any further information I find on this thing, I'll uh, like I said, I'll post it on the forum. Okay guys, thanks for watching. See you next time. Okay guys, just pulled up. Here's a better example of that wattle we were just looking at. That other one was a pretty ordinary specimen actually. Almost dead. Um, yeah, again there the leaves. Same as what we saw before. But here we go. Here's the gum I was telling you about. This thing's absolutely covered in it. Thing is the grubs get in these, which I'm guessing can be edible, similar to a witchetty grub. Um, so yeah, I mean, I'll get a bit of this stuff, stick it in my gob and uh, that's, the, that's the stuff there. Not bad, a bit tasteless, but edible. So, you know, you're out looking for a bit of a sugar hit. No, it's not too bad. I'll go another piece. Um, yeah, you're out looking for a sugar hit out in the bush. I reckon this is the go. Okay, thanks, guys.